How's it going, Joker family? It's your boy, Haha ha Joker, aka the Black Joker, back at it again with the Madden video for you guys. If this is your first time checking out one of my videos, first time you come to the channel, man. Make sure you guys drop a like, and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel, man. We're on the road to 1K. Make sure you guys hit that sub button, man. It's free, it only takes one second. With that being said, let's go ahead and jump straight into this. Now, as you guys can see, we have limited time Dak Prescott and also limited time. Jared Cook. Now, obviously, I know Jared Cook played for the Raiders, but he's an LTD. I'm not going to obviously spend that much coins on him like that. But if you guys are interested in seeing a Jared, Go Gook. Jared Cook gameplay, you guys let me know. I'll do my best to get the card and I'll get some gameplay on him. You know what I'm saying? But um, again, it, we're on the back end now of Team of the Week. So, you know, week 16 and week 17 have already been released, so we already know team of the year is going to be right around the corner soon, as a matter of fact. Um, you guys should, if you guys have been keeping up with this, you guys should have already enough, more than enough already at this point of the uh, team of the year tokens. Even if you missed a few, you they still give you some, like, EA still gives you some, like, lead way, you know what I'm saying? So, as you guys can see here, um, the game of the week stuff, um, they have it. I don't know why I have two of these. Oh, I guess one was for week 16 when I completed it. But the actual game of the week, as you guys can see, play the game of the week to earn the team of the year tokens. And you should have 14 out of 17. You know what I'm saying? Out of 17 that you can get, all you need is 14. You know what I'm saying? So you're able to miss three, if so be it, if you couldn't get around to it or whatever the case is. But as it is, that's what it is right now. And as you guys can see, we get the player sometime in january so you know very soon but besides that what i do plan on doing for this channel right is that i already told you guys that we had i i was planning on doing a dolphins theme team so i went ahead and we're gonna go ahead and do the dolphins theme team now i'm gonna show you what i have done and also i'm gonna get into why i'm doing a dolphins theme team for some people that are new some people that are just coming to my channel stuff like that I know a lot of people are going to say, why don't you do a more current team? Maybe a team that's going to be in a Super Bowl, a team that's in the playoffs, whatever so have you. I understand that, but here's the thing. Number one, I don't want to bandwagon on those teams. You know what I'm saying? For, I guess, content purposes. You know what I'm saying? I'm not really a fan of any of those teams. Now, maybe players. Yeah, of course. You know what I'm saying? I'm a fan of Lamar. Um, I'm a fan of Derrick Henry, even though they both been eliminated already um i'm honestly pulling for patrick mahomes win another championship kind of go back to back type of thing and you know he's gonna have his work cut out for him against tom brady but it is what it is but that's what i'm pulling for but that doesn't mean i'm gonna make my theme team based around the chiefs you know what i'm saying because i'm not a fan of the chiefs so i'm not gonna you know what i'm saying i'm not gonna really do that now for the dolphins as most of you guys know i am a dolphins fan all right i'm born in florida born in 305 so it, I've always been a Miami fan in a sense. I've always been a Dolphin fan, Hurricane fan. Um, I don't really watch baseball like that, but if I had to pick a baseball team, obviously the Marlins. So for me, that that's just what it's always been. And for some people I've already explained this to, but the reason I started off doing a Raiders theme team is because when I first started doing YouTube, before I did YouTube, I did Twitch. And the like very first person who obviously wasn't a friend of mine that was following me follow me on my channel was as some of you guys know who've been rocking me for a long time was madden beast madden beast was an oakland raiders fan and he you know pushed the idea to me that you should start your channel with a raiders theme team now again at the time currently the raiders weren't good at the time of me first putting out my Raiders steam team video this was before the nfl 100s before the the dickerson with the nfl 100 and the bow and the this that and the third before all of that all right i have posted raiders content and obviously like i said in current day at that time raiders weren't really that good and even as we push further along ahead and throughout the year when they 
um, stop putting stumbling, um, stumble recoveries in the in the game, and trying to do their best to slow down the run game because a lot of people were complaining and stuff about that. Even when all of that was going on, and we had what the three best running backs in the game between Bo and Eric Dickerson, people would still say obviously the Ravens were the top tier team because they had Lamar in his MVP year, and then they still said the 49ers because of Steve Young and so on and so forth. You know what I'm saying? So. Um, a lot of people this year are starting to um, get onto this, onto the Raiders bandwagon in a sense. I guess I, in a sense, have done the same thing. But like I said, I was posting Raiders content since last year, but like not really a lot of people were using Raiders theme teams. And now, obviously, since the Raiders are OP this year, everybody, I've seen a lot of people on YouTube completely switch up their entire offense and defense to accommodate for a Raiders theme team. Whereas for me, as you guys know, from last year going to this year, I, I came out the gate Raiders content. So, you know, it is what it is. But like I said, as far as the Dolphins go, I am a Dolphins fan first at the end of the day. So it was only right for me that I had the coins and this and that to go ahead and make the Dolphins theme team. And for right now, as far as content purposes, for me to keep it to just at least two teams, at least two teams that I personally like, even though they're not currently in the playoffs and they, the only chance of them really getting upgrades for the Raiders or the Dolphins is through, you know, possibly team of the year, um, ULs, and whatever other random promos that they decide to put out. But, um, you know, we're not going to get any playoffs. We're not going to get a Super Bowl player. So, you know, it is what it is. But anyways, as far as the Dolphins theme team goes, this is what we have so far. Um, again, as you guys can see, we have a lot of it already maxed out. Richie, Richie Incognito has still got Raiders Kims, but I will switch it over when I'm completely done with the Dolphins theme team. But we have Mark Clayton. We have uh, Ricky Williams. We don't have Arian Foster maxed out yet, but we will get to that. Him and Seau are the two players that we need to have maxed out before I would get Dolphins gameplay to you guys. Um, Reggie Bush also needs to be act maxed out too, but he's pretty cheap. I'm not really too concerned about that. Um, we have Tannehill, um, Dan Marino. And on defense, like I said, we have J Junior Seau who needs to be maxed out, but everywhere else is maxed out. Troy Vincent, Jorge Finnegan, Damian Howard, they're all... We're, we're good everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Now, like I said, we only need three things now at this point. Number one, we need a training to get locked down on everybody on defense and um, to get physical cams and so on and so forth. That's We need training for that, so it's going to cost, cost quite a bit, you know what I'm saying? But um, we need a training to get them physical cams and obviously their um, team cams. Not their team cams, but their, um, their lockdowns and stuff like that, their other chemistries. And on defense, I mean on offense, is the same thing. We obviously still need the training to upgrade Arian Foster. We need a training to upgrade Seau, but we also need to buy their top um, top players. You know, their, um, the last card that came out for them. And Junior Seau, his is 96. Arian Foster, his is also a 96. And like I said, Reggie Bush is pretty cheap, but again, we have to get the training to get... Um, I think I'm going to rock play fake for these guys, since I'm already doing it on Raiders and it kind of works out already. But we're going to probably go play fake on the offense and maybe um, kind of like the same thing, put zone run on the running backs or whatever the case is. So that's what we have so far as far as the Dolphins theme team, man. Um, I do hope by doing this, I will pull more people into my channel, more Dolphins fans into my channel. Not because the people that are Oakland Raiders fans, you know, they really accepted me, even knowing that I am a, a Dolphins fan. They accepted me. They never gave me shit for putting out Raiders content. A lot of people enjoyed my Raiders content. You guys continue to support me on my Raiders video, so thank you for that. But like I said, um, this putting out another theme team, at least a theme team that I'm comfortable and happy putting out with and not just bandwagoning on current teams that are in the playoffs now, I feel like Dolphins best suits what I want to do right now. So that way I can get content on both sides of the spectrum and on top of that, grow this channel and we can hit that goal of hitting 1K subs, you know what I'm saying? But um, either way, man, when I do decide to put out the Dolphins content, man, I do hope you guys enjoy the videos and hope you guys continue rock with me. I'm not going away from the Raiders content. Um, when Raiders players do drop, I still plan on picking them up, still giving you guys gameplay. And even for Weekend League, I'm still going to be running 50 out of 50 Raiders. And as you guys can see, um, I don't know why I exit out of it, but as you guys can see, if I go to change lineup, 
I still got my Raiders players. You know what I'm saying? Raiders are still perfectly fine, perfectly intact. I didn't move anybody. I didn't sell nobody. Uh, why is my right outside line? Oh, I picked up um, what's his name's power up, and then I powered him up. Forgot to put him back in. So <clears throat> as you guys can see, everything there's no changes. You know what I'm saying? But I am slightly shifting the content a little bit just so I could target more people that are fans that are Dolphins. And again, like I said, I don't see a lot of people posting Dolphins gameplays like that, especially Dolphins theme teams. So kind of kind of works hand in hand being a Dolphins fan. You know what I'm saying? So I do hope you guys will enjoy the videos when I decide to put them out whenever I do get the coins to completely finish the Dolphins theme team. And you guys let me know your thoughts on this decision I've made and the um, route that I'm deciding to go with this channel right now. Like I said, nothing's really changed with the Raiders theme team. I will post Raiders gameplay whenever I can or whenever you guys ask me to. Don't really matter to me. But at the end of the day, I hope you guys enjoy any content that I do put out. But either way, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If so, make sure you guys drop some likes on the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Joker family support always means a lot. Till next one, guys. Peace.